Hey everybody, this is the Sliders Review, and I'm here today to talk to you about Secrets of Sulphur Springs has been canceled. Oh, this really bites. Oh, that really bites. I enjoy this show. I, I don't really do the whole Disney thing that much no more, but this show intrigued me. It reminded me of So Weird. I like the fact that Disney was trying different things, was willing to go a little darker, willing to go there and stuff. And oh, it's crazy because like two days ago, probably, I was searching to see if this got canceled or not because there has been no word since season three um, ended like a while back, like last year and stuff. So I've been checking, checking, checking. I haven't been checking lately and I'm scrolling through YouTube and I was um, scrolling through like, you know, the recommendation thing and what's on Disney Plus said that it got canceled. I'm like, no, it ended on a cliffhanger. <laughs> Oh God, no, that's the cliffhanger. Oh, that, that, that really bites right there when it ended on a cliffhanger. Maybe the whole having a child from the future probably ruffled some feathers because you know, they're just teenagers and stuff and their child from the future came like to the past and everything. Maybe it just ran this course. Um, you know, because it did start to get a little bit darker with the last season with that man, uh, or with that person dying and the ghost and sending him down to, you know, where <laughs> and everything. I think Disney's kind of like, yo, we ain't really, really go that far. <laughs> Let's dial it back to the kiddo stuff. And so like, yeah. It, it, it went as dark as they could go for a kid's television show, but th th this just really sucks, man. This was a really cool, intriguing show. I reviewed every season and stuff. It was just a very different show. Sometimes the outcome wasn't always what I wanted. Um, sometimes they kind of like, you know, dialed it back a little too much. But other than that, it was a really good show. And yeah, this really bites. Okay, so the show is about two kids who meet each other at school for the first time. They become friends and they're told that the house that the boy now lives in is haunted because the girl went missing there. And so basically um, their parents know each other, don't like each other. And they start hanging around the house to go down the basement, find a time machine and they go through it. And so it turns out that they met the girl that went missing, but they also met their parents at a younger age. So they try to prevent her from going missing. Turns out the girl never went missing. She just traveled through time. They um, travel to go with her. They go back to like as far as 1930s and stuff. And just like all kind of like, you know, interesting stuff starts to happen. So the ghost that was haunting the place wasn't that of like the little girl who went missing. It's a completely different ghost. Then there's another ghost. The one girl tries to like prevent her dad from dying. And it's just like really different. See, I told you shows on Disney plus only last for as long as one to three seasons tops. For whatever reason, they don't like to renew. Also, they probably don't want to renew contracts and crap like that. And, you know, because now they're going to start this whole no password sharing thing, I believe, next month. Mufasa did not die for this. I'm so pissed I could flip a table. Alrighty, well, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.